So this is Cucumus mellow variety flexuosus, otherwise known as the Armenian cucumber. And I first saw it in the Quranic gardens in Sharjah, the Islamic botanical gardens. And it's creeping along the ground and a really healthy, uh, vibrant flower, yellow flower plant. And it's very, very hairy at the base of the flowers, the young growth coming out. And then you have the sort of undulating leaves and as they get older they get slightly fleshy and more undulating and hairy so just doing some preliminary drawings of the plant and then down to these lovely yellow flowers <laughs> they'll be yellow when i paint them um, a little seed i actually took seed back and grew it on in in new zealand and so i had living material to work from a cross section of the fruit the cucumbers that i saw in dubai in the fruit market, cross section of the flower and the young cucumbers, although these can get much, much longer, hundreds of uh, millimeters long. And then across here to the preliminary color notes and then also the creases in the, in the cucumber fruit and here on the petal, the flowers, all sorts of different yellows are used. So Hansa yellow, Van Damme yellow, cadmium yellow. Um, I've got cadmium yellow, lemon here as the base colour to keep the vibrancy. And then Hansa yellow for the deeper yellow. And then also permanent rose, adding in permanent rose to bring in the warmth. And then down here, cerulean blue to, to get the green, of the, the green tinge as it's the base of the petals. So these are some of the preliminary colour notes for the Armenian cucumber from Sharjah. And then we'll move on to the, see the final painting. So this is the final painting. So from seed from Sharjah to Dubai to seed grown on in New Zealand, I grew the plant and here's showing a cross section of the flower and this lovely vibrant. So I've drawn the flower several times bigger to be able to see the detail and the undulating petals that are creased and tuck in. So keeping those the shape and the creases in the petals and then the hairs on the edges and on the back of the petals there are even some hairs through the leaves themselves as well and all the hairy stems here and this is all hairy around the buds <laughs> everything is hairy um, and then as the flower goes over you get this most beautiful color change so bringing in the warm permanent rose and deeper carmine to get that lovely beautiful change as it's going over and the tendril so that's the, the fabulous flower but trying to keep the yellows clean using different yellows that I've just mentioned in the color notes and then across to the the young cucumbers and we've got the creases in the fruit so keeping that structure so the overall structure of the fruit itself so here I've got a disappearing edge and the cooler colors and then coming through to the warmer colors in the light so cooler on the right and warmer and still having all the creases here and tucking the creases in underneath and then a bigger cucumber some of these get to a few hundred millimeters long they are quite incredible and they are delicious as well and then you get little um, white specks little markings on the cucumber skin itself so again here it's quite clear the warmer more yellows and then the cooler colors on the right hand edge as it's disappearing keeping the overall shape so this is the final painting of the armenian cucumber that i initially saw in sharjah and then in the markets in dubai with the cucumbers and then i grew it on in new zealand as well so fabulous to do lots of challenges with the hairs keeping the colors clean so I mean you
Thank you, Kanta. Yum.